Thank you for those that prayed. Now we have a call on the line, is that right? Uh -huh. Yes, ma'am. It's Dawn from Florida. Is this Dawn? Yes, sir. All right. Yes, Dawn. I'm at the hospital now with my father. Okay, you... Can you hear me? Barely, I think that we need to tweak it a little bit. I don't hear clearly the things you're saying. Okay, I'm sorry. Is that any better? That's better, yes. Okay. Houston. One second. Hold on a second. Yeah, hold on a second. I got my friend helping me. Okay. Um, yeah, my dad, he's um, not doing good at all. He's, his organs are shutting down and he don't, they don't think he'll make it. Uh, is, he in the is he in the hospital now? Or at home. Yeah, he's nice to you on life support. Uh -huh. Well, I, I know what you're calling about, Dawn. We, we'd gotten a, a message earlier, and it's you're not all that clear. I'm not sure what's going on tonight. But I'm going to go ahead and pray as well, and I'm going to ask everyone in the audience here and everyone listening everywhere else uh, to stand and join hands in unity for the prayer of the healing of your father. Are you with me, Dawn? All right. Yes, sir. And we and we have we, I know we have another caller on the line as well. Uh, just hold on until we've completed this prayer and we will certainly take your call as well. Jesus, we uh we know that you are a healer. And nothing is impossible for you. We know that there's no sickness, there's no disease. There's no infirmity, there's no default that you cannot heal. Now we have Dawn who has been a faithful member of this ministry, Lord, for, as you know, a large number of years. She's been in this house and uh, she has prayed with us and supported us for years. And uh, her father is not well. And the doctors or the people responsible or others are not speaking good words that he will will be able to continue and his life be extended but Jesus you've got the final word on this matter you always have had you know the number of the hairs on our head and certainly when we will take our last breath that's left in your hands and no one else and so Jesus in your mercy and love, we ask for healing tonight of Dawn's father, yes. that you would heal him yes, yes. and that you would raise him up, yes, Lord. that his daughter may be able to enjoy him a few more days and maybe do some of the things that didn't get a chance yet to do, but would have an extended period of joy and, and, and fellowship with her father. In the name of Jesus, we speak the power of healing. In the name of Jesus, we speak healing into his body right now. In the name of Jesus, we speak the power of healing and restoration. In the name of Jesus, we speak rise up and walk. In the name, in the name of Jesus, do we speak healing. The power of the healing anointing of Jesus upon this, your servant. Hallelujah and amen. Amen. God bless you, Dawn. Uh, God bless you, man. Yeah, Thank you so much. You quite welcome. Keep praying for us as well, Dawn. Now we thought we had I, another healer, another prayer. Y'all may take your seats. We, I believe, we had another prayer. That one disengaged. Is that right? Well, you can call back. We, you call back. We'll wait for your call if that's what you want to do. I understand? You probably want to get off the line and and pray with us. While we're waiting, we're going to ask Beulah to come up and say a word of prayer. Praise the Lord.